told you. But he was a bit jealous a Mabari chose you and not him. Ah, <sighs> poor Carver. There's a good boy. Mistress Hawk, Ariane tells me you sought a better path than the Circle for her son, Fainriel. I thought perhaps you would be willing to show mages a kindness once more. Can I get the details before I agree? There are a number of apostates hiding in those caverns. We are not going to kill apostates for you. I was hoping you might speak to the group. Convince them to surrender peacefully before my fellow Templars arrive. Catching runaway mages is your job. These mages have shown they attack Templars on sight. You have a better chance than I to convince them they are better off alive in the Circle than free and dead. Sir Karas hunts them as well. If they have not surrendered by the time he arrives, this will be a bloodbath. Blessing. I thought I was going to die down here in this... this tomb. Are you with the Templars? Please, I need to go back to the Circle. I never wanted to get involved in this. Not when he started making those... those... things. Tell me, how many are with you? Where are they? There are maybe a dozen of us left. Everyone who survived the Starkhaven fire. They're hiding in the caves. Decimus set wards, protections. He's the one who raised the dead. I ran. Decimus is wrong. Blood magic is a work of evil, not just a power the Templars keep from us for spite. Someone starts raising undead, and it's all downhill from there. I've been at the Circle since I was six. I've heard about demons, blood magic. They warned us, but I never thought I'd see it. The rest of them, they're still following Decimus. He's gone mad. I think he'd kill us all just to take the Templars down. So Thrask waits outside. You will be safe there. Templars have come to take us back to the Circle. Decimus, no! Stay your hand. These are no Templars. What do I care what shield they carry? If they challenge us, the dead themselves will meet the call. of the circle how is it you side against your own maybe your lover should have tried hello we're friendlier than you think decimus gave us the courage to face the templars without him we would be prisoners still the minute he resorted to blood magic he signed his execution warrant i warned him i told him once he marked himself as a blood mage that was all anyone would see she won't admit it, but it's obvious she's just as corrupted. I swear to you, I have had no truck with demons. Please, we only want our freedom. Without your help, the Templars will execute us all for Decimus's crimes. What do you ask of me? There is a Templar who followed us. You must have met him when you entered. Kill him, and we can get clear of Kirkwall before the Templars send more men. Better the death of one Templar than 
so many innocents. They would have us kill a man for doing the just work of a Templar. Will you buy us time to flee Kirkwall? I will do what I can to help, but not at the cost of Thrask's life. If you will not kill him, then you must convince him you killed us. That is our only hope. But I spent two weeks traveling with these Templars. They strike first and think after. They are far easier to kill than to fool. Are you trying to tell me this boy is all that's left of the apostates? I ran away when they began to use blood magic, sir. They are not in the cavern, Sir Karas. I have thoroughly explored. Who is this? I was helping Sir Thrask. The apostates are all dead. Dead? But I asked. You've always been soft on the robes, Thrask. Makes me wonder if these demon worshippers haven't gotten their fingers into your mind. Men, search the caverns and keep these interlopers under guard until we see what's in there. Tell your men to stand down. Show these fools what happens when you interfere with a Templar's investigation. of the Maker, they're dead. I wanted this to end peacefully, not... There can be no peace between the Mages and Templars of Kirkwall, sir. It has gone too far. Your people should leave. Others will come looking for them soon. Why are you still here, sir? Why did you not fight alongside your fellows? I... I would not join my name to the likes of Koras. But I cannot support blood magic, either. I suppose my side has been picked. I will tell the other Templars you killed Karas and I came upon the bodies. I will give a false trail to follow. Thank you. And thank you. Please accept this as the only reward I can offer. I dare not carry a staff with the mark of Starkhaven on it now. This has been more than I expected. We must away. As must we. Come, Alan. I'm sorry you were the only one I could save. You found it. I seek no trouble. I meant to warn you. But you are no caravan. You are tracking. The path ahead is littered with my kind. If you are as skilled as you look, it would please me if you killed them. turned your back on your kin. Yes, for a second time. I did not like my role, so I left the cube. I do not wish to be a murdering thief, so I left these Talvish off to warn their victims. You are no victim, so now I will leave. If they have offended you so much, help me go after them. But I am worse. They don't want to raise their swords for coin, so they murder and steal. They cling to the honor they held under the cune. My sword means nothing. I will sell it and myself as mercenary. Kunare would say I am worse. Do I 
really have to convince you to do the right thing. I have already done more than was demanded, by my own choice. You have my word of caution, human. Heed it or do not. As long as I live, I will not understand the Canari. To the Canari. Let me pass. I have business with the dwarf Javaris and your Arashok. The short mouth, yes. Enter if you must, Basra. Ah, my right hand arrives. Summon your era, Shock. The bargain is done. About time you showed. I've been here for hours. Ari Shokost. Maras Chokra, Anan Isamkun. Look hewn from an elf. The madness of this place. Tell me that helped. We shall see. Yes, well, that said, I'm here to report that your hated Talvashoth were felled, one and all, right? Yes, they were. So, I'm ready to open negotiations for the explosive powder, as we agreed. No. He's not getting it. Make your chatty elf say something. You arranged this. You deal with it. Well, you see, it is customary that effort deserves reward. I think I've shown how common need could benefit us both. You asked for the Gatlock and were refused, so you invented a task and then paid to have it done. You failed your own goal. You have proved your wealth, not worth, and Kunari still owe you nothing. Nevertheless, you have benefited from his action. Do you think we are unable to hunt our own outcasts? This was interference, nothing more. So I get nothing for all this work? If anything, we have been denied the righteous application of the wisdom of the Kune. What payment should I exact for that? Go, Dwarf, before I begin my tally. You may want to take this opportunity to go. But he has to sell. It's a product. People want it. There is no profit in empowering those not of the Kune. The means of creating the Gatlock is ours alone. It shall be dispensed only to our enemies, in the traditional manner. You are a frustrating people. And you're fired, sobbing bunch of oxmen and dog lords, a whole lot breathing smoke. Pah. You will leave as well, human. There's no more coin for you here.